Good evening, I'm Luke Clary. Thanks for joining us. And we start tonight with breaking news. A shooting in the Arden Arcade area. And we know that a man was taken to the hospital after being shot more than once, but he's said to be in stable condition. We have Garshpal Sangha live there now. Garshpal, what can you tell us? Yeah, Luke, this is still a very active investigation. Police of, uh, of officials still here on scene trying to figure out exactly what happened here. We're standing here on Edison Avenue, just kind of right off of that watt. Now that general area is where the Capital City Freeway meets up with Interstate 80, but Sacramento County Sheriff's Office on scene trying to figure out exactly what happened. Now we're told it happened around 220 in front of this apartment complex called the Edison. Sergeant Amar Gandhi with the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office says two men knew each other and were arguing in the driveway when the suspect uh, the the suspect shot the victim at least three times. Now that victim is a 63 year old, is in stable condition and is at the hospital and is, and is expected to survive. Now that suspect, however, ran away and police are trying to find them. Now a lot of witnesses in the area, that is why this investigation is taking a little longer than it would otherwise as police are trying to make sure they collect all that evidence. But we're told the roads are going to be closed in this area for a while. Again, we're here on Edison Avenue, just kind of near Watt. Now, obviously, whenever there's a shooting, it's a scary situation. You never want it to happen, but uh, police is sort of relieved. If it was going to happen, that it was going to happen today because just a feet away is a middle school. So Labor Day, school is out, but this is the Arcade Fundamental Middle School. So luckily, no kids were here at the school when this shooting happened. So that is good news. Also, the other good news, the person who was shot is expected to survive luke yeah so finding the good news in all of this certainly though a neighborhood on edge our garage Paul sangha reporting live for us thank you